Hello and welcome. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to troubleshoot and fix your Wi-Fi connection on your PC. Unfortunately, this is still a common problem. First, we'll try with the Diagnose Network Problems. To do this, right-click on your network pictogram and select Diagnose Network Problems. Sometimes, Windows will provide you with a solution. In this case, it says to enable the Wi-Fi adapter but it might suggest a different solution for you, or not even suggest one at all. Follow the steps if possible. Next we'll check if WLAN autoconfig is set to active. To do this, type services in the Windows search bar, right click on it and select run as administrator. Scroll down until you reach WLAN autoconfig, double click on it, and set the startup type to automatic. Click on start and also on apply and OK. If this was already running, simply right click on it and select restart. So before we continue, make sure that the problem is only on this device and that you have other devices like a mobile phone that can connect to your Wi Fi. If that isn't the case, the problem lies with your router which you should restart before doing anything else. Assuming that the problem is related to your PC, we continue with the Wi-Fi adapters. Search for View Network Connections. In here, you should have your Wi-Fi adapter. If it is disabled, right-click on it and select Enable. If it was already enabled, right-click on it and select Disable. After that, enable it again. While you are here, it's a good idea to check if the IPv4 setting is checked. Right click on the adapter and select properties. Make sure that the box next to Internet Protocol version 4 is checked. Check the box and click on OK. Hopefully, this fixes your Wi Fi. Next thing to try is updating or reinstalling the Wi Fi drivers. Search for Device Manager in the Windows search bar, click on it, go to Network Adapters, click on the arrow to expand it. In here, search for something with Wi-Fi or Network Adapter in the name, right-click on it and select Update Driver. Click on Browse My Computer for Drivers, select Let me pick from a list of available drivers. If you have multiple options here, select the most recent one first, otherwise just select the one that you can and click on next. This will reinstall the driver. If that doesn't fix your Wi-Fi, you can do a proper reinstall by first uninstalling the driver. Right click on it again and select uninstall device. Click on uninstall to continue. After this, reboot your PC and Windows will automatically reinstall the driver. After the reinstall, select your Wi-Fi channel and re-enter the password. If your Wi-Fi still doesn't work, we continue by clearing the DNS cache on your PC. Click on the Windows search icon and type in CMD. Right-click on Command Prompt and select Run as Administrator. In here, you need to enter the command ipconfig space forward slash flush DNS. This command clears all items in your DNS cache, which might have gotten corrupt. Next, we are going to do a release and renew of the IP address. First, enter ipconfig space forward slash release. After that, wait a short bit, like half a minute, and enter the next command. ipconfig space forward slash renew. Again, check if this fixed the Wi-Fi connection. The last thing we can try is to perform a network reset. You can do this very easily by searching for Network Reset in the Windows search bar. A network reset removes and reinstalls your network adapters. It also sets all of the networking components back to their original settings. When the reset is done, you need to reboot your PC. Hopefully you have a working Wi-Fi connection once more. Thank you for watching and I hope to see you in the next one.